Alex? Dad? <laughs> What's up, Dad? <laughs> What's happening? You need to come home and see your mom. An accident turns George Clooney's life upside down in the new indie dramedy, The Descendants. I'm the backup parent, the understudy. I thought you were supposed to be getting your act together. I've been doing really well, actually. Nobody ever seems to notice that. With his wife in the hospital, Clooney's character is forced to be Mr. Mom to two daughters, a precocious 10-year-old and a rebellious 17-year-old, played by newcomer Shailene Woodley. It was great to take a character who had a hard shell around her and who thought she knew everything and so independent and blah, 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 and break her down and make her vulnerable and show her emotional side and also show her brilliant side. She is a very smart young woman. And I, it was fun for me to kind of break that cliche of, oh, you know, the the teenager in movies who are, who's awful and never gets it. I have to go around and tell people what's happening, family and a few close friends. I don't want to talk about mom with anyone. Look, whatever you two fought about, you have to drop it. Grow up. You really don't have a clue, do you? Tim, mom was cheating on you. Tears were streaming down. People were handing me napkins. I was crying throughout. That's the brilliance of Alexander Payne, right? He he takes a scene in three minutes and makes you cry. And while your tears are still strolling down your face, you're laughing hysterically. And then you go back to crying immediately. He's so brilliant in finding the comedy in life as well as the touching emotional moments. And so for us actors, at least me personally, all I had to do was read the words and deliver them. Sid's coming over. Who's Sid? Really good friend from Punahou. We're in school together for years. OK. He wants to be here for me with all the happening. She's got a mouth. Those lines had to be quite oh, fun. It was right? so fun. When, in, <laughs> when do you ever get to use that language right. to, <laughs> to someone like George Clooney or to a 10? The things I would tell the 10-year-old to say. I mean, goodness, it was, it was really fun. He didn't want to sign. <laughs> How was he on set with you? George Clooney is amazing. It's, uh, you can say any word you want, but he, amazing is kind of the word that is all encompassing. He is brilliant and down to earth and humble and grateful and giving, and I could go on and on and on. So on set, he was never in his trailer, never in hair and makeup, always on set chilling with the crafty guys or hanging out with the transfer guys or there wasn't any intimidation factor there was no oh my gosh this is george clooney i gotta be this or do that you were working with another human being who was grateful to be there as well